<laughs> now, Reese, uh, I've never acted in a movie. I imagine, though, I've been told, right, that doing a comedy is much, much more difficult than doing drama. We know you can do drama. Um, did you learn anything new about comedy from Sophia? Did she teach you any yeah, comedy I mean, skills? she's incredible. I taught her everything she knows. She did. <laughs> Um, she's just really self-deprecating and very funny and makes fun of herself and she was just game for anything. But I was really excited to work with her because it's like, even the people behind the camera were laughing so hard every time she said anything. It was hard to just even say serious. And, um, Sophia, uh, if you could just, if I could just look at my notes. I've yeah, lost my concentration just for one second. Sorry, I'm really nervous. Sorry, guys. Um, oh, right. Um, so, uh, da -da -da. right, I was going to switch to motherhood at this point. I have two minutes left. Mm -hmm. Sorry. So, you both share the experience of motherhood as well. I wanted to ask you both how important your family is, what kind of moms you are. Well, it's at the utmost importance. Family is everything. Um, you know, that's all you have at the end of the day. You know, every your career can go away, you, you know, but your family takes care of you. So... Um, and I feel like that's the same with Sophia. Yeah. Very much her family is very close. Yeah, to Latin families were very close. Like, you know, I always like to be surrounded by them. It gives you, you know, a meaning to enjoying all the things that you are able to, like, achieve in, in your career, in your life. It's it's not for yourself, but to share with the people you love. Like, and... And, and they're so proud of yeah, you. I'm so happy a, for it's you. It's fun. Was there ever a time where you just thought, oh, I'm just going to retire from acting and just be a mom, enjoy life? Um, Retire. I well, my my I son is twenty three. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> me too. No, I don't know if I, I if I woke up and I was a princess one day. That would be amazing. Um, but I have to work. Um, I can't be a mommy right now because my son is almost twenty four. So he's like. <laughs> so how do you maintain your balance? How do you stay sane? Um, I think it's you know I try to do normal things that I that I've always done that I like to do like going to lunches with my friends, shopping, eating. Traveling with my family, you know, you can lose like all the things that you enjoy and that you love because then it's like how boring. What do your kids teach you, by the way? What do you learn from Patience, your children? Kindness. Technology for me. My <laughs> son is like he teaches me everything. You know, keeps me updated of, of what's going on in the world out there. Yeah, I can't remember my password all the time. They teach me my passwords. Yeah. Well, I think you're both active, pretty active on social media. I mean, just about everybody is these days. Probably because we have kids. Yeah, I learned that <laughs> my son taught me, actually. Well, you're very generous, actually, yeah. with your fans. Um, how do you know, like, how do you draw a line? Or what's the limit to what you're going to post to your fans? Okay. I recently interviewed Vin Diesel. He's got 9 million Facebook fans. Oh, my God. You know? That's insane. How do you deal with that these days? It's getting more complicated for I think, for example, actresses. I like tweeting things when I'm at work mainly, like, you know, about my work, about uh, my projects, about events that I go. Um, I'm not really, like, tweeting, like, oh, I'm, like, I'm wearing these shoes and I'm, mm -hmm. like, eating this. But I do, but, like, it's mainly for, for, you know, to show my fans, you know, about the work and about the projects and, you know. And how do you basically maintain your sanity with 24-7 tabloid media attention? Mm. I mean, I, you know, we live in Europe. Germany is, you know, nothing like this, you know. I know, here this it's insane like insane. Here. insane you, yeah. Seriously, I mean, how I do you guys... No, I don't read anymore, but, like, you know, there's sometimes it's impossible to see, like, big news that are completely, like, invented or that are some completely, like, super... Um, uh, unprofessional, I think now. And sometimes uh, the comments on social media yeah. are so disgusting. Yeah, it's like it's it's a it's a, it's a but really you can, weird thing. You can thing. report them and stuff if they're. Yeah. I mean, that's the world we live in. You gotta be tough and yeah, kind of not listen and sort of be impervious. I think. Well, you both seem really balanced and pretty sane to me. So you're doing a we're great. Very job. normal. You are. <laughs> <laughs> Well, listen, uh, before just, we just wrap up... Just regular old girls <laughs> next girls door. Next door, That's yeah. us. <laughs> just a simple Latin girl. And just yeah. a simple Southern lady. Exactly. <laughs>